This is Dr. Sam Benjamin. Now, with all of this hot weather, you're no doubt hearing a lot about keeping well hydrated, even when you're not feeling thirsty. In fact, especially when you're not feeling thirsty. But although that's important, and you really cannot hear enough about it, you know, about keeping hydrated, it's your medicine that I'm worried about. Temperatures above 86 degrees Fahrenheit can render some medications useless. In fact, improper storage of medications in the heat may affect the bioavailability of active agents in the drugs. The U.S. Pharmacopeia, that's the USP, you've seen that, those letters around. Uh, and, and they're the Medication Standards Agency. They state that drugs generally should be stored at room temperature between 68 and 77 degrees Fahrenheit, with only brief excursions to temperatures as low as 59 degrees or as high as 86 degrees. Well, uh, they don't live in Arizona, right? Notwithstanding that, and, and, and that's an important issue, keeping drugs that you take in this range in the summer uh, here in Arizona, that's a challenge. How are you going to do that? Outside of this range, there is no guarantee that your medications will work. And I've seen recently some patients with hypertension, and they've been concerned because their blood pressures had increased, which they ascribed to the weather. It's hot out. Well, they're partially right. One patient was a trucker and left his blood pressure meds in his vehicle, and he did that as he made deliveries. The temperature can get very high. As you well know, living in Arizona, 120 degree plus range right now is not unusual in a car. Uh, by the way, I chose a black car and black interior and steering wheel. I think I'm a real genius, right? I, I'm, I'm paying the price right now. The other patient, at any rate, worked in and out of a greenhouse and left her medications on the table exposed to the sun. The temperature's very high all day long. Both of my patients saw a normalization of their blood pressure when they transferred their medications to cooler places. So, keeping cool is one thing, and keeping your medications cool, that's another. Your best bet, keep them with you at all times, no matter how hot it is. This is Dr. Sam Benjamin with medical news that you can use.